What's up, guys? I'm the Nerdy Ginger, and this is Spencer. Hello there. Why do you have a pumpkin on your head? I mean, it's close to Halloween, so maybe that's why. <laughs> All right. We still got half a month. <laughs> All right. Welcome back to our walkthrough of our Minecraft custom map, The Legend of Zelda: The Star Crystal, where we last left off. We defeated the third dungeon, Boldstone Bold Prison. Boldstone Prison. Jinx. <laughs> Zelda has called us to our castle, so you know what we're gonna do? Not but, go to the castle because yeah. we have some side quest stuff that we can do. Collecting, as we would. I mean, we don't have a lot of shit to get, but we got some. Two things <laughs> in particular. All right. One of the things that we can get is actually at the top of Boldstone Mountain, which we did not show you guys in the last episode because we no. couldn't really do anything with it. But anyway, we're just going to have to walk all the way back up there. I'll speed this up. All right, here we go. So this is actually where the, we got the minecart. If we headed over yep. to the left right here, we got a little bit of There's parkour that we can do. Hardcore, hardcore car, park, oh. whatever. I can't speak. Oh my god, why is this fence post here? That fence post is annoying me, Spencer. I should move so I don't push you. <laughs> okay, hey, you there did. There we go. If this one, now, you just kind of want to sneak to the edge of this yeah. and just jump. The... It, it might be tricky, but eventually you will get it. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, I guess you got it. Man, right. there's snow up here now. Oh man. It must be very high up. If you remember in the last episode, we got the Golden Ring of Power. And if you know anything about fantasy... I'll do this guy. Let's hope <laughs> you'll I know can, who, uh... wa who might want this ring. <laughs> oh my god. It's Gollum. It's Gollum. Thanks you very much for finding us our precious. As thanks for finding our precious, we would <laughs> like to give you our favorite meal, fish. Take it as a gift of remembrance. Oh, why, thank and I, you, and it cleared your effects. And I understand effect. that sounds... It cleared your like effects, Spencer. Don't play a multiplayer. And I, I get that that's not a golem voice, but I try, okay? <laughs> not necessarily easy doing many voices. <laughs> no, it is not. Anyway, so that was a, so that was a part of our trade quest. So now... Now we're going to speed up our descent down the mountain again. <laughs> Mm, punch punch all right here we are we are, and i uh -oh. fell in the lava again which because... means you're spawning at boldstone prison no we're not we because we set no, you're the spawn not over here. we set the spawn over here because uh -huh. i'm oh, smart yeah, that's right. like that anyway well, i didn't need to keep anyway there's one more extra thing that we can get and it's actually back in lost Sifity ruins i don't think it was actually in our previous version of the update actually it was not we added it because we needed more heart fragments and what and Originally, I, I'm not getting teleported. There we go. Oh god damn it! And originally, the key's what? not the key's not in there because this is a reset version of the world again. <laughs> but originally, after you would get the fire staff, we there was really nothing you would do with it afterwards. Oh, you got in my way. So I decided to make it like somewhat useful. It's it's kind of like the spinner from Twilight Princess. Doesn't have a lot of a lot of uses. <laughs> Only it's not outside. As awesome. Well, then again, you can no. actually light people on fire with this, so it is pretty awesome, actually. Hey, Steven. Oh, God. Oh, God. They've been upgraded. Any no, 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 no. They have super speed. Okay, anyway, but remember Brigham, guys. There was actually a thing that was in his little secret staircase that we just added. We didn't reset, but I just did, so don't worry about it. <laughs> it's just basically just a quick little fire puzzle. If you light these, you'll be able to get another heart fragment. Da -da -da. Amazing. What is that, number six? Oh, my God. Why do I keep getting lag spikes? I don't know. Is that number? How many? I think that's number six or seven. That that would be seven because I have three in my inventory right now. All right, then it's seven. So now we're just gonna. We're just, oh my god! Why do I keep getting lag spikes? Jeez. I don't know. I think I might be getting it too. <laughs> anyway, we're now we're actually gonna start progressing the story, and we're gonna talk to, to Zelda. Zelda. We talk to Zelda. Get my you gonna voice Zelda voice, for me, Spencer? I will. I don't really have a feminine voice. Do voice I'm glad to see you back in one piece. I wanted to tell you that I found out where the next star crystal fragment is. It would appear as though the star crystal fragment is located in the seafloor obelisk owned by the Zoras. Ever since the monsters have taken control of it, the Zoras have not been able to go back there. You will find the way to the Zoras palace to your left as you leave the castle. Good luck. Ta-da! Did it take your fragment? Yes, it did, actually. Okay. Amazing. I'm actually good. All right, I'm gonna go. Before we go on, I'm just gonna cut and go go back to Lost City Castle Town, stock up and stuff. All right, guys. So back in Lost City Castle Town, we're actually gonna show you some new stuff that we added to the blacksmith. Get in there. We added honeydew. 
And he, and, and he can enchant our bows and sell arrows, which we didn't have in our previous update. No. We also added this guy who just stands here and does nothing. <laughs> That's it's amazing. It's for symmetry. So actually, I so since I have quite a bit of money, I'm actually going to use this guy and buy some enchantments from him. Let's see. I think I, I'll, I'll buy um, Protection 1 so I can enchant my Iron Helmet. Yep. <laughs> Let's see. What else can I get? I'll, I'll get Power 1 for my bow because I like to destroy things. And also notice that currently you can't oh, upgrade punch as well. your Sorry. currently you can't upgrade any of your heart piece armor. That you'll see that not in this part, but in the next part <laughs> exists. And look at this, guys! Infinity. We have an we have an infinity <laughs> enchantment, and it's for six, twenty emerald blocks. Sixteen block. emerald blocks, actually. Is what's oh, in there. Well, I guess it got changed back then. So this guy, this so this so you can actually enchant your bow with infinity in here. But I tried to put as many combinations in here as I can. But you can only fit so many combinations into a chest, which we used to set up. Yeah. So basically, once you enchant it with infinity, you're not going to be able to enchant anything else. So I'd recommend enchanting your bow with these other things before beforehand. So first, I'm going to enchant my bow with power one, the power one that I just bought. Sweetness. Yeah. I'm going to have to find the other combination that has a power bow in it. Let's see. Power one bow, and I'll be able to upgrade <laughs> it to power one and punch one. So now I've got extra power. And if you don't know... Knockback. And if you yeah, punch is knockback. <laughs> Not extra damage, just knockback. All right, and then I'll use this guy. Let's see. I can't enchant my heart hat because there'll be a special Not guy yet. to do that later. But I can, I can do it with my alloy leggings. So I'll give that protection one. So now I've got quite a bit of upgrades. Had some stuff to spend my money go. on. You can take some hits. <laughs> All right. So I've got some extra enchantments on. I'm just gonna turn in my heart fragments, and then we'll continue on. All right, now it's finally time to move on. So, if you'll notice, this little river area right over here, if you head over to the right, we can head down it's here. It's very dark and ominous cave, as if we've had one, as if we've never had one of these in our map before. <laughs> it gets another area. All right, Woo! let's light this torch. What the All right, heck? I'll, I'll back up. We got you like do a, this for We got like a bunch of Zora statues. You do this one. Weary adventurer, if you wish to pass into Lake Lossifity, you must solve my riddle. Each of the Zora statues before you represent characters in a story. Flip the levers of the five main characters of my short tale, and I will let you pass. Okay, okay, so we got a little story will problem. You? Listen carefully, hero. There was once a young Zora princess named Mabel. She had the hearts of her subjects and was constantly surrounded by men who wished to court her. S despite all these potential bachelors, she had eyes for another man. She looked through the crowd and saw her one true love staring at her from a distance, a dashing young commoner named Clarence. I added young, but oh well. <laughs> Mabel's father, who acted as her right-hand advisor, did not, <laughs> did not approve of their love due to Clarence being of low social class. Nonetheless, Mabel refused to see anyone else. Sneaking up on Clarence was Mabel's ex-lover, Delos. <laughs> Filled with jealousy after Mabel leaving him, he slowly approaches Clarence with a weapon in hand. One lone bystander spots the lover turned killer, but is too far away to stop the heinous act. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. CSI. That, that concludes my story. <laughs> now, flip the levers of the statues that represent Mabel, Clarence, Father, Delos, and the bystander. Pay attention to the directions that the statue heads are facing. Okay, that was a long story. So it is. If, all right, Man, so Steven, you, you gotta work on your voice acting skills. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know how to be an ominous, random voice. I mean, I guess that's true, but All right, whatever. let's go in order. So let's see. Try to figure out which one of these is Mabel. The, the story says that she's constantly surrounded by people that wish to court her. Looking yeah. at her. So we got all the... I see the, we got this little circle of people. They're all staring at this person yeah. in the middle. So I'm going to guess that you flipped that for me. I did, yes. All right, who's Clarence? I'm your right-hand advisor. All right, who, just a sec. <laughs> who's Clarence? So she says she's staring at the so she's staring at him through the crowd. So let's watch where she's going. I see this guy over boop, boop. here, who seems to be looking at her as well. So I'm gonna guess that this is Clarence. Who's her father? Her father is her right hand advisor. <clears throat> so if we go to her right, stop flipping the levers for me, Spencer. <laughs> <laughs> this will be her father because it's on her right hand notice how we did that again make the right decision spencer stop <laughs> okay so ne now what's next delos the guy who's gonna be sneaking up on clarence so he must be right next to him 
this I don't see anyone else that's looking at Clarence right here, so it must be this guy. He's got pretend he's got a weapon in hand. <laughs> and then we have the bystander, who's the one guy that should be looking directly at him. At this guy. I see this person, this person right here. He's the only one that is looking directly at this lover turned killer. So let's flip his lover. Spencer, which <laughs> lever did you unflip? None. <laughs> nah, I got slowness. I was too close. Ah! Congratulations, you have solved my riddle, so I deem you worthy of passing. Hopefully you can stop the threat that I could not. Hmm. That's foreshadow. I wonder everybody. what that could possibly mean. So that was Very a cool puzzle inspired. So that was a cool puzzle inspired by Phantom Hourglass slash Spirit Tracks. All right, what do we get? Lake Lossifity. Lake Lossifity. Spencer, turn it to daytime because I want it to be daytime. It looks better at daytime. This place looks better at night, honestly. Oh, whatever. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'll set it back tonight. <laughs> I don't real. I, I I don't really care to be honest. Okay, then it's going tonight. <laughs> We haven't really had any areas in night on this Let's Play yet. I, I don't know, because I guess I just like it in day better. Anyway, we're I mean, just going to... it makes it easier to see. So we're just going to be walking around down this river. Wait, you, you went the wrong way, man. Don't you have to go this way? Am I... Not really, but fine. I guess I can go this way. There must be something over here, right? Hey, some why else would it be here? Only those who can soar can make it over the river. Well, there's no way I can make that jump. I'm not even going to bother trying. No, but you'll maybe. fail and you'll be you'll be dunked in the river. <laughs> but maybe. Have fun getting back like, out. Hey, look at it. There's the beacon to the Lossifity Warp House. I just noticed yeah, yeah. that. That's I cool. like this view, uh, by the way. It's like yeah. it's majestic. I remember making this. It was cool. It was. All right. Take Didn't a look even around. take that long either. Take a look around. Let's see. Because our lake we've is a giant teeny we... pit. All right. So we've got the Warp House over there. we got actually a boat shop over there. we got something down there. I think we'll head over there a little I bit later. Do. I was going in there. Parkour I cavern. Do. What could possibly be at the end of here? L. <laughs> I fail at the first jump. And it... Oh. I was closer. <laughs> it's hell, Stephen. That's what's behind uh. there, number one. Okay. Let's... This... Some crazy hard parkour. Ugh. But there's a reason for it. You'll see the reward and be like, oh my gosh. It was well, it was totally not worth it. Actually, it is. Okay. If you want to be a completionist, you must do this. Damn it. <laughs> you must do this park lower ligand. And don't try jumping on the sides. I barrier block the hell out of them. <laughs> so good luck. You can't make them. Ladder parkour is amazing. Just kind of sneak over to the edge here. And just kind of turn. Oh, this is difficult. Ugh. I think it can be. There we go. And that's basically how the rest of this parkour is going to go with this type of yeah. jump. So I guess I, mean, I can just kind of fast forward through this if if I can <laughs> not suck. <laughs> Come on, Steve, <clears throat> do it. Oh, my God. <laughs> I like how all I have to do is move farther and all of a sudden you just die. Now this last jump is actually somewhat of a challenge. Oh, oh. <laughs> There's one more ladder. I've now, got this. Steven, I've got this. Go to the go to the right. Go to the corner. Go to the right. The far right or the little corner. Like the... go to the right. Just somewhere on the right side. I think that that's the okay. easier path. I've to got go. this. I've got this. Not yes. Oh, it's there. Finally, it. that took forever. Use About our torch. Ten minutes. Light this actually up. Not... Heart fragment, and that'll actually be enough to get another. And you oh, warped I back, warped right? you back. I was trying to go back myself. <laughs> Jeez, that took forever. Wow, it actually changed time. It took so long. Wait, I hear silverfish. Oh, dear God. I also oh, no, Steven, you got some company over here. No. What <laughs> you is got that? some skelly, skelly friends. Oh, I, I thought it was a different mob. What's this guy? <laughs> Bo? He sells boats. I got your boats. Get yours now. The supplies last. I don't really need one. I'm fine with that. No, there, we just needed something else to put here. <laughs> it was so plain. All right, let's activate the warp house. We got to keep those activated so we can warp back here whenever we want. But I mean, it, uh, to be fair, it's a lake. What can you have in a lake? Look at this view over here, Steven. What's over here? Wait, one sec. What's... You just see the mountain. I'll have to turn up my render distance for that, actually. Yeah. It actually looks kind of cool, though. Yeah. 
there's a cave over here, but we can't get in here. So I guess the only other oh. thing left to do. Looks like is oh, go no. back around, Steven. If I... Nope, it's time. Ugh, going under. Holy crap, oh, I yes. can barely see. Oh, no. Yeah, well, that'll change. Oh, no. No, I will <laughs> I not drown. I will not I drown. Slowly, I can see you slowly floating uh, down. No. Depth. Help me. Air. Air. Oh, just barely. Just barely. All right, what's this place? The Zoran Palace. Oh, okay, yes, I did fix that. Never mind. <laughs> All right, sweet. Steven? What's up? It is time. Oh, dear God. <laughs> <laughs> it is time. Well, You'll see in a moment, guys. You'll well, see in a moment. So welcome to the Zorn Palace. This is kind of like an apartment complex, sort of. This is pretty much. I am out here because my children will not stop screaming at each other. I am too lazy to parent them. All right, let's, well, go, see. let's go see about their parents. <laughs> you're stupid. No, you're stupid. No, you're stupid. No, you're stupid. No, you're stupid. I'm awesome. I'm awesome. No, you're awesome. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. That was your Crap. sign. <laughs> hey, let's go steal all their stuff. Yes, there actually there are also chests in here, so we can also take these. Free food. Although I don't really feel like it because I'm lazy. You're gonna skip all the emeralds. The, check all the houses. We'll show you the important stuff. <laughs> Which is only one. <laughs> one in particular. Ah. Oh yeah. Talk. Which one? You is gotta it? talk to the neighbor at I'm least. I'm trying to find it. I'm trying to find talk it. To, it's like it's this okay, one there right it is. Here. Okay. Talk let's, to the neighbor first. Talk to the neighbor. And then talk to the little what's kid. All, what's all going on here, guy? A demon named Herobrine came to the palace and murdered our queen. Oh, jeez. Murdered mm, the that's queen. That's interesting. Who knows when he will come back? I don't know how our neighbors could be doing what they are doing at a time like this. Uh, let's go. Let's go what talk to the little girl. What could they possibly be doing? Let's see what the little girl has to say. What are mommy and daddy doing in there? Whatever it is, it sounds like dad's winning. What? <laughs> what? Care to, care to step on the pressure plate, Steven? I don't want to. I don't want Do to. Uh, that's something we made. Uh, uh, that's something we made for uh, the fourth dungeon. Uh, oh, gross! I do not even want to think. Dude, about you got an achievement for it. <laughs> I don't even hey, want to think about this. Is it this tower? No, it's not this tower. One of these towers has a trade quest in it. <laughs> Let's go do that. Some anything to take off, take my mind off of what we just heard. All right, up hey, here. Hey. Up here. There's a person up here. <gasps> Ew, it's rotting. Well, food is food. Here's a gift for your thoughtfulness. Oh, yeah, that fish that we got from Gollum. What did he give us? Uh, golden sand. Rare sand found by the... Oh, yeah, that's right. I didn't turn on my resource pack. Again! There we Notice go. It's not, it's not. It's not even. It's not even really changed. But oh well. I should still have. No, my that I don't. That's just a uh, yellow dye. I should just have my resource pack on. Anyway, that's basically most of the Neither. important stuff that we can do in here. Except, that oh, here actually, can. I'll show. I'll show you the center, just because this is where. Oh, yeah. This is basically the where the shopping room. districts are. I sell delicious seaweed. This stuff is packed with nutrients. So yeah, take a look around the shop. See if there's anything you like. There's nothing I really need right now. Anyway, that'll be everything that we really I'm need to do I'm going to show my here. custom seaweed model I made. <laughs> it actually oh, turned wow. out really good. Anyway, so we're going to head down to the basement here. And, ooh, who's this dun, guy? Dun, dun, this must dun, be the Zora dun, King. Dun, dun. The derpy Zora King. Oh, I got potion affected. <laughs> of course you did. Slash effect. Ah, uh, you should do the king. Human. What are you doing in the Palace of the Zoras? What? Queen Zelda sent you? You need access to the seafloor obelisk. Herobrine, oh, uh, Herobrine was here just a few nights ago. He, he murdered my wife, my queen. She was trying to prevent him from taking our tribe's wither skull, but he failed to protect, but, but she failed to protect it. I failed to protect her. I was useless. I'm sorry. I know you need access to the obelisk in order to stop Herobrine, but the cavern that houses it is too deep for a human like you. You will surely drown if you try to swim down there. Unless you obtain the Zora armor that the hero in green once used. I don't know why I'm laughing. Smetch is doing stupid stuff. <laughs> that armor would allow you to breathe underwater. <laughs> After the hero in green completed his quest and gave the armor back to our ancestors, and it has been passed down through each of our generations of Zora royalty. I think I just completely misread that. That yeah. same armor is now buried along with my beloved wife. I hate to say this, but if you want to reach the seafloor obelisk without drowning, <laughs> you'll have to go to the queen's gravesite and take the armor. 
Her grave is guarded, and those guards may very well kill you <laughs> if you go there. <laughs> those guards. <laughs> this is the only way that you will be able to reach the obelisk, I'm afraid. You, you, you are undeterred? Well, since you're going there, you're going to need this key. Also, can you please take this note to my to leave it at my wife's grave? I have some things that I did not get to say to her before she died. Thank you for this, Hero. I hope you can stop the demon that killed her. Hey, Steven. What's look that? At, look at the guy. Look at the guy. <gasps> oh, my God. You just broke through his <laughs> oh face. Oh, my God. Look at his face. Oh, my God. <laughs> Why would you do that, Spencer? That is disgusting. <laughs> oh my god okay so we got that's king was, Azor. that's so what we got i was king... laughing about all right so we got king azur's letter as well as the zoran key that could probably get us into that cave that we saw earlier let's uh swim back up there all right here we are let's so let's open this up, boy up dun, dun, where are the guards dun. Hmm. Dun, uh, well fire rod time Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Killer rabbits! No! They actually do a lot of damage, too. Uh, kill him! Kill him! Oh my god! Oh jeez! No! One's getting away, Spencer. One's getting away. Oh, go get it! No, 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 no! I'm actually gonna get wrecked. I actually might die. Oh, get, get, get back here! You got him! Oh god! I'm scared! Oh my god! It's coming for me! It's coming for me! Get away! Get away! Ugh. Oh jeez, that lag spike. Where's the last one? Where'd the last it's one go? Out here. Did it run away? It ran away. Get it! No, it's in the grass, so I can't hit it. Come back here. No, 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 no. Come back. There we go. Well, Spencer, <laughs> what? The... Oh god, Spencer! It killed you. That was your fault. You distracted me. I was about to hit it. <laughs> There we now, go. here's something to note. We originally wanted to have two iron golems, but there was no way to make them aggro, so we couldn't do that. Then we had guardians, or not guardians, then we shulkers. had um, shulkers, but they freaking teleport, couldn't use that. So I was like, you know what, let's just... Killer let's rabbits. Use I found killer rabbits, like, you know what, perfect. Alright, here that. we are. This must be, this is the queen's grave site. Who dares enter the site of my grave? Hey, that's gray text. Remember gray text from earlier? Wait, are you the same human that solved the riddle back in the river cave? You, you have a letter for me? From my husband? To my beloved Queen Azarine. Words cannot <laughs> describe how much regret I have. While you stood up to Herobrine to defend our people, I cowered and hid behind. I cowered and hid and watched you die at his hands. I know that I haven't said this to you as much as I should have, especially in our later years. But I love you. I will miss you until the end of my days, but I want you to rest knowing that in your absence, I will make up for the coward that I have been, and I will be the great leader that our people need. I will honor your memory. The hero that stands before you has the true potential to stop here, O'Brien. Please grant him use of the Holy Zoran armor so that he can make it to the obelisk and obtain what he needs to imprison the demon. Please, my love, so that he may avenge you for what that demon did, your husband and king, Azur. Oh my god, that was so special. Spencer, what the hell? You ruined the moment. <laughs> Azur, I miss you too. So, Mr. Hero, <laughs> you truly believe that you can stop Hero, Brian? The Just demon that killed me, text. as well as countless others? Yes, uh, your determination gives me hope. I, I will give you this sacred Zoran armor so that you can live and breathe underwater just like the Zoras can. Azur, I am ready to pass on from this world. I love you, and I truly believe that you will become a great king again. Thank you, Hero. Oh my god, that was so sweet. That was so, that was so sweet, but Spencer ruined the moment. Oh my god, respiration and depth strider. This is going to make a water level so much less annoying. What? You won't get to see it until next episode. <laughs> okay, well, we're, we're going to put some of this stuff on. We actually don't need to put on all of this to get like all the Zora effects. So I'm just going to put on the chest plate and probably the and probably the flippers and we honestly don't really need the rest of it so i'm just gonna chuck it in the water and totally the more you put on the faster you go though <laughs> really well, well you get like try to like i mean i just figured because i've got an iron helmet as well as protection on my pants I mean, it's understandable stuff. yes all right guys so let's swim down to the obelisk and then we'll end the episode there. Look at it. We can actually see underwater and we can swim super fast. We can't really sink all that fast. Uh, but... I don't have that armor, though. I probably should have taken the stuff that you didn't. What? Because I can't see. <laughs> anyway, so we, if you know, we didn't actually try to go down here first. Oh, there's squids. <laughs> we didn't yep. try to go down here first. But if you had tried to come down here without this armor, you would come definitely drown, just as they said. Oh, I thought you were an enemy for a second, Spencer. Kill a squid. <laughs> Kill a squid. 
Yeah! I murdered the squid. The... I wanted to give life to the lake, so I added them. Alright, I wish you could just... sink faster, but... Yeah. Oh well, at least you That's won't like drown. Iron boots are Steven and Zelda, We're almost here. Don't... We're almost here. We're almost here. The seafloor obelisk. Let us go. Wait. And we are going hey. to end the episode right here, right outside yeah. of the dungeon. Hello there. <laughs> I'm the Nerdy Ginger, and this is Spencer. Hello there. Be sure to leave a like on this video, <laughs> leave a comment, and subscribe. And, of course, download our map using the link in the description. We will take on the fourth dungeon in the next episode. Bye-bye, guys.